please tell us your name. I'm uh, Agamemnon something here. Uh, my name is something. His Holiness the Dalai Lama asked us to record your experiences so that we can share your memories with many generations of Tibetans, the Chinese, and the rest of the world. Your memories will help us to document the true history, culture, and beliefs of the Tibetan people. Do you give your permission for the Tibet Oral History Project to use this interview? Uh, that's very good. Thank you for offering to share your story with us. Okay. Uh, I'm very happy that you are interviewing me. Thank you very much. Um, during this interview, if you wish to take a break or stop at any time, please let me know. If you do not wish to answer a question or talk about something, let me know. Mm. Okay. If this interview was shown in Tibet or China, would this be a problem for you? Uh, uh, no problem, because the Chinese are our enemies, and if they see this interview, I'm happy. Uh, I will be causing them uh, harm, so that's why I'm very happy. Okay. We are honored to record your story and appreciate your participation in this project. Pala, um, can you please tell me uh, where you were born? Uh, my hometown is called Reke. Reke. And what was the nearest monastery or temple to your home? Uh, um, uh, there was a monastery called Makongshi. There was another uh, a monastery called Relamgun. Relamgun only. Katorin zi tsono buge dansa res. Relamgun was the seat of Kartok Rinzin Tsawang. Tsawang Nobu. Tsawang Nobu. Kartok Rinzin Tsewang Norbu was born in our uh, village and he was related to my family. I see. I see. Uh, Pala, what, what, uh, what year were you born? Pala, Tung Lo de Kati Rela. Tung Lo de. Or how old are you now? Um, I think I was born in 1935. I see. Okay. And, to, and today, how old are you? Uh, I'm 81 years old now. And when you were born, um, what kind of work uh, did your family do for a living? Uh, 
Mandro no me toque o yumro ni yer, yuba dom ropa ni. So our family consisted of uh, two parts, one that engaged in farming and one in uh, uh, nomadic work. Mm -hmm. And can you tell me, do you have any memories of your childhood, what it was like? I mean, um, Palagi Tandarwa, Ugochinji, Bekabi, Tensut in the Kariyuna. Nachun Chunkunle or Trim Sendien Sogatonta, Pamage. When I was small, uh, my parents used to send me out to herd animals. Oh, and uh, what kind of animals were you take looking after? And <laughs> So um, we owned about uh, 500 sheep and 100 D and yaks and then uh, 12 to 13 horses and mules and uh, as nomads uh, we used to you know herd these animals. So is it okay to, uh, you know, narrate in, uh, in small paragraphs? Of course. Whatever is easier. Did you enjoy herding uh, what, and have many adventures? Uh, when I was small, uh, it was very cold, and then um, I suffered on account of my feet turning very cold, and I cannot forget this. Mm. Uh, did you not have warm enough shoes? Is that what happened, uh, that you were... Troubled by the cold? And then we covered the cold. We covered so we had uh, um, some uh, uh, woolen leggings um, below which uh, was uh, leather the below which was the leather part and if this got wet uh, it would tear so when we had to ford a river, we always oh. took off uh, took off the uh, shoes, and then uh, stones would you know stick to our feet, mm -hmm. and uh, it was very painful. Oh. Very hard. Was the your family uh, were they well off or medium income? What was your economic status? <laughs> ดิงานังละเรคันเดตะวิจีนะอ่าคันเดสแต่มีซางกีกิวชอบลูจีออรัวอ่าเพลชูเบกับละอ่าคันกิวชอบกะทางละเลกเรดิงานทางละเลกเ
So ours was uh, one of the better of families. Mm -hmm. uh, the middle class ones would have only about 200 sheep and about uh, 50 other animals. Uh, whereas the poorer families would have around 100 sheep and 40 to 50 other animals. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, and Paula, were there other children in the family and how many were there? Um, <laughs> so uh, my parents had uh, uh, five sons and four daughters. So, and where were you in that lineup? I was the youngest. Uh, and how, as the youngest child, how were you treated in the family? Then <laughs> Um, since I was the youngest, they took great care of me, and uh, at the nomadic uh, side, we had uh, butter, meat, cheese, curd, and milk. Uh -huh. And what were, do you have any favorite memories of your childhood? And who were in Begi Kapirua? Tanda Tensu Kibu, Tinde Karidue. Tensu Kibu, Tinde. Um, that um, since there were no schools in our region, so we were with our parents and then uh, had the responsibility for herding the animals. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can you tell me a little bit about your parents? Like, what kind of a person was your father? Yeah. <laughs> My father's uh, name was uh, Lobsang, and he was a very kind-hearted person, and he engaged in farming and uh, raising animals. And uh, my father had constructed a uh, um uh money prayer wheel he was very spiritual mm. and uh, but in our region uh, there was no custom of doing any trade mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and what about your mother can you tell us a little bit about your mother ane palagi ama kande jeulji na ama pe semba zombo bugutsole pe jambo yore tirenga chunchun kunle tiren khomba nonle tso yundile ama se nimbe uh, my mother was very kind-hearted and very loving to the children. And when I was small and returned, when I was small, at any time when I returned home, I would call out to my mother. And um, if she wasn't home, I wouldn't go in. Oh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So at what age were you at? Taking care of the animals in the and in, in the mountains in the fields. Lord, <laughs> So around the age of eight or nine, because um, uh, there's a saying that at the age of eight you lose your teeth, uh -huh. and uh, when the when when you start losing your teeth, you're old enough to take care of the animals. 
And uh, what kind of a little boy were you? Were you shy or adventuresome? What kind of child? And Bala Puchinji, she make up La Roa, Pupukande, Dobajurat, Mozachin Buddha, Jure, Yantik, Pazidogong, Dobajuna, Pong, a chunchun, Masiba, Suboyore, Tren, Bolio Mare, Sari, Tender Zoni, Trente, Yadima, Dice, Tendece, Tren, Monzo, Yuba, no letta, Tumro, Tender Yoroa, Tetso, Chumlo, Marigo, Chingin, Comba. As a small child, I was extremely naughty, and there, there were no balls then, so we used to make uh, uh, balls out of mud and then play with it and then uh, there would be uh, wooden houses on which you know, I would strike stones and then run away mm -hmm. and also fight with other children. <laughs> what, well, how did your parents respond to your um, you know, misbehavior? What did they do? They <laughs> Um, when I fought with other children, my parents would beat me. Uh, with their hands, a stick, how did they beat you? Uh, not with stick, but they would slap. Uh -huh. uh, not harshly. Mm -hmm. So, uh, does your anything dramatic or significant happen in your childhood that you would like to tell us about? Um, Manzun Lumba letter, uh, young, loved and that men do delay. Tring a maconchu gamba nole, or Payilva one rodney, three Payilva metinale, de dile train, or Chido Cazare, Ama train, uh, Munduni, mean on Chumacho, tender chain. Not Payilva one rodney, means still loved and mama yomare. De lo, um, Kiki the cobble, uh, Payilva one day. Um, uh, there were no, not, nothing untoward happened, and uh, when I was a child, there were no uh, schools in our region, mm -hmm. so I went to study Tibetan in the monastery of Marpongshi, and uh, I used to miss my mother so much that I would cry at night. Uh, I was around 11 years old then. Mm. And how long did you stay there, Pala? I was there two years studying Tibetan and then I could um, read and write well. Were you, did your parents um, in uh, encourage every child to go and learn Tibetan, or was that unusual for for your family? Uh, it was um, <laughs> some parents that sent their children to study, while some parents didn't, um, but made them made the children to herd animals and do other work, mm -hmm. and uh, they were they didn't have much interest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why do you think your parents were, were had interest in your education? 
Ani pala gi pamangi gi ta tonan chumbu doala kari na dide. Ati ngi papa te to chichi o lepa yong en tenda de trim pule ta yen lok jong mena to yi tihe go gre se kole te samno yor. Uh, my father was, uh, you know, quite smart, and he uh, he felt that, you know, even if we didn't have any other education, we must know how, uh, know Tibetan well. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so, uh, it, how old were you when you actually went uh, to school for those two years? What what years were they in your life? Did you uh law uh in the bad the I was about ten and then till twelve I studied there. Twelve. And what happens in your life after age twelve? What are some other things that happen? Trin <laughs> There wasn't much to do except, you know, uh, herding the animals. There was no trade and uh, no shops set up and none, no other work except, you know, animal work and then consuming the products. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, the, what happens in your adolescence? Are there any adventures or experiences that happen that you can tell us about? Any <laughs> 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 Then when I turned older, I wanted to go to Lhasa to see the image of the Cho and uh, ran away from home. Mm. Oh, I wonder, I wonder how old you were at that when you ran away from home to see the Cho in Lhasa. Lhasa la Cho jega pedi gane khonglo khaju ina. Tedi lo piche. Yes, you know the layers, you know. Around 20. Uh huh. Uh huh. So, Trent Lassale, oh, some year though, tende, uh, try up and rather tende, near Soma, Jane, Tenale, uh, Dawn in the Lassale Devi. Then at Hassa, I went to visit some year and many other pilgrim sites for about two months. Mm -hmm. uh, for people who don't know, could you s tell us what you meant by wanting to see the Cho? What is the Cho? Mm. Uh, is a very holy image and uh, it is like a, 
the heart for all Tibetans and people love to go and see the Chowo. Mm -hmm. Why did Chose, you? Chose any of the Janani, Jaza Yong Jung Sengate, or Purge Jabo, Tuson de Senge, Namati de Tele, Kale, Tagaz, Tendakere, Chemboyer, Lema. That's a Chemboyer. Uh, the Cho is a very large holy image mm -hmm. and brought by so. um, the Chinese wife or uh, for the Songzen Gambo as dowry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when you said you ran away from home, uh, was it not possible to get your parents' permission to go before you went on pilgrimage? Palagi. Uh -uh. Nangne Tuni and in Negola Pebadwa Chick and Ma Tuba Chen in Pamalaya Gandhi Shuba Yina and it Pebia Ragi or Mare. Chin Tongue Mare. Tati Mundo Lumba Lumba Tits Lumfunda Naki to Severan to Dule Tene Flasandra to Sacha Yel and Rona Tre put the young Mayungo Mare, Pushin Rogres, Pamagi Pe Sachambo Chen Tongue Mare. So um, the parents would never give permission and ours was a very remote village and people believed that if the sons went to Lhasa, they would die and never return. So it was the same with all the people in my village. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And how did you know about Lhasa? How, where did you hear about the Cho and all these various sites. How how did you find out about that? In Palagirwala, and in Hasata, and in the Cho Jaya Yobata, Ne Corsa Yobata, did they any countries pure? Did the Minhaman Rome get the song get train, catch a chain to do the train, Lasalachi in Rogo, and do George and Jane Rogo, and do some, then a Samba non let and then a um, there were people from our village who had gone to Lhasa earlier and returned, uh -huh. and I heard from them. And then when they talked about it, I wished to go to Lhasa mm. and see the Cho. Mm. Can you tell us a little bit about the journey? Like, did somebody go with you? Uh, how long did it take? And did you have any adventures on the way? Anita and Hassel Pebberwa, the Lamla Candy Chung, so any Ropa Susuyana Candestini Pebe. Lassa Le Yundule, Ropa Mundo Payuge, me, a Gio, or Tedo Yum de la Trin, or Yumi, Chamdo Le Clair Wundule, Trim Ponda Tonsen, Neton Chambo Giore, or Tedo Mundo Mundo Paco, Jero Paco Serre. The don in Rea Chamboyer, the cot sal and roni, train Nalha sal and rowing, John Jan rowing in the Namota non la ton roches, lobdile, train a cog motor, the latch chain, train motor no tons, they do motor zotaria. Pondat, pondat. Pondat. There was another person from my hometown, and we traveled together, mm. and when we reached Hamdo, there was one very wealthy a person called Panda Sang, uh, whom uh, we requested that uh, we wanted to go on a pilgrimage to Hasa, and uh, he sent us in a vehicle. At that time, uh, there were vehicles available. Oh, how did you happen to know this wealthy person from Chamdo? Ani palagi tanda Chamdo leya michupu Panda Sang langi di kandi smo kengi yore. Ote mando mando. เชื่อพระโสเสงวนโซนเลยิเดโรพระโกเสงเปมาสิบกุรุเชมบุจิโยเรเมตุงทรายโยเจเรเตนะกีปัญญาเตนระกีปัญญาปัญญาปัญญา
but I pleaded that I wanted to go on the uh, news and be uh-huh. rendered help. Uh-huh. Why? Why did your family think that people uh, that children? Why did the village think that if you went to Lhasa you would die? Ni ah, pala number two ki chongsit na larwa. Ta ah, pudon zul hazal jona ani shiduris karis ani samgi yena. Ta je dini ya chindro chandro dul mai hongro chegi o marwa. Tema mayu na nongge meti lado isi nongge rendo gyori tige <hesitation> tene <hesitation> ko lendro na mense ngele tsawa nyine tongo kumare. So um those uh, sometimes those that went to Lhasa did not return. So the fam- for the family it was like losing one person. That's why unless you you know ran off you wouldn't be given permission to go there. Mm-hmm. So did you? Did you know how to drive a vehicle, or were you uh, given uh, a driver? Um, did you palagi gadi motor tang shingi yuna ya motor na la loop ni tang e shamba yuna. Marte jami ke motor no le lachai ni motor lava no le ngundo ponda pengge lachai ni trilha sa pada tombre. It was a Chinese vehicle, and the uh, ponda family. Mm, You know, paid paid for uh, us and sent us to Lhasa. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And so, can you tell us what your first impressions were when you saw Lhasa? That Lhasa la pebrwa. I think my Tangul has a city gone a country that will be going there. Lhasa John Ye Ye Jura di le te Samba Gabo Chung. Then, um, that Pai No Le Rong Den Di Di Le. Then Yagen Ro Di Le. Oh, that Sam Komba Me. Tere tenda sakono le de gudi tere pesha kambo che semba semba hida idu pochi na shipo de chichu masu. I felt uh, very happy to see the child image, and uh, however we were no longer in our hometown and there was no house to stay and uh, we had to live and stay in a hotel and there was no money and I felt very sad. Mm. What happened next? Can I carry you to the jail? Ah, the jail is there. Danny, Danny, there is Kumbon on the way to Umbre. Ah, by the way, you bought on Europe any year? You bought the logit and the dishes to my son. Did Tanda see any dig maro? Ah, then after two months, I uh, went towards Congo, and. Uh, And I have not been able to talk about the uh, farming part of uh, our life in the village. So can I talk about sure. it now? Sure. Yes. Thanda sona dibido. Oh, Shimba di. Shimba. Kene, ah, gundo le ropa do Shimba ni yore. Kene Shimba no le tengkunte brusen ya nga senge tengre. Ndo, ndo naka nga tengre. Brusen na nga. Kene do do ji ne do ni. Rau do sam <hesitation> trema do ye soa do nga <hesitation> te <hesitation> yuba no le tong kung te yore. Kere ngo tse <hesitation> ngo tse te yuma do labu shoko te sam tong kere. Te men tse te ne tong kung tse kong yoma re. Ta te <hesitation> yuba ge no nye te tong kung te <hesitation> te kala sa ya tse. Tete tren ropa non i cha manche tren saian tun ya do pe be bo yore. Our family uh, both did farming and raising animals, mm-hmm. and the produce from the farm were four types of grains. Uh, they were wheat, uh, barley, mm-hmm. uh, buckwheat, peas, and another type called soa. And uh, for vegetables, there was uh, a radish, turnip, potatoes, but nothing else. So mm. these were consumed, and uh, from uh, the <coughs> uh, nomadic part of our family, we received meat, butter, and there was plenty to eat. Mm. And why do you think it's important for me to know about this? Source of food. Why do you think that's important? Ani thanda kala raya gi juda donzu yorwa donzu korla ngazu gotsuya di karisini kechingu res ha koya di. 
Tada so you are asking about uh, the produce yeah. in our in our uh, hometown, and uh, it is important to know what is produced on the farm and what is from the animals. So by learning these, you know how we led our livelihood. Uh, yes. Uh, <laughs> During summer, uh, all the family members uh, went up the mountain with the animals for uh, three months, and during winter uh, came down to the farming region. And um, should the family have many members, uh, its members uh, herded the animals. If not, we'd have to hire uh, other people mm -hmm. to do so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else, uh, Pala, you want to tell me about your livelihood of your family? Uh, uh, so uh, the produce from the farming and the dairying part uh, was enough to sustain us and there was no need to uh, go on long you know journeys mm. to procure food mm -hmm. uh, and there was no trade at all mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so the families were very self sufficient this is the name so 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 the so ne ne to be or up again la o tig ne to go to go jata cho yor karisena on ropa no ni shama bebo yor shama yuba no le tene we had sufficient. Mm -hmm. There was plenty of meat and butter, and then there was plenty of grains to make zampa and bread. Mm. Well, we left you in in the uh, uh, Lhasa. Uh, uh, I'd love to know what happens next. Uh, <laughs> then after two months in Hasa, uh, I went to Kongpo. Ah, oh, what did you do there? Kongpo la karina ina. Kongpo no le ngage chemoji or simo. <laughs> in Kongpo, I went and lived uh, with a younger sister. Uh -huh. What was it like? Can you tell us about Kongpo? Kongpo no le lumba shedang ge tunkung saian tunya pe bebo brusin nanga tetsun tomarange tren lumba no tunkung ya po yor tenga ge simo te o. Um, in Kongpo, there was uh, plenty to eat and um, they had good income and my sister had married a husband, had met a man and married there and they were quite well off. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, I was very poor at that time, so I lived with them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
And what continue? What happens now in your life? Any days you have to change your life. That three three days later, ah, um, should you go to the jamil le molob jamil? Because ah, mommy, ah, should you go to mommy? Ah, then the mumbo ki kumbu no less heavier. Still love them. Then the our Shushi Gandu had rebelled against the Chinese, and many of their soldiers arrived in Congo. Then, ngaki samno le ota ngaki chugi gondo mami no lendroni ta jami le nzing gondo sami. Then chugi gondo mami yasale tanga chimbi. Ine. Uh, I wish to join the Chushi Gangduk to fight the Chinese, and so I went uh, where the Chushi Gangduk were. Kare na tini Chushi Gangduk yasale ndodi le jamu ge Chushi Gangduk jie de tani juu huni jamu mama mbapo mbacha mbaki doni tu ni tena lenga jamu ge simshas jamu ge simbere. So um. When I uh, went to join the Chushi Gandu, the Chinese were in pursuit and I was caught. The Chinese were in pursuit. Pursu in pursuit. 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 You, like, were you, were you walking or um, on a horse going to join them? How, how, how were they pursuing you? I mean, the Kabla Pala, um, Tanda Chushi Gandu, Tugala Pepe Gane, Tagala Pepe, or a candidate of Tachan. Tatchani rapo rapo ki ning minin rodile tren mami do tuni mami ge simchoni tren tini ya tasa le ya tesu tasa nobili. We were there was there were two of us and we were riding on horseback and the soldiers caught us and took us to Nobilinka in Tasa. Wow. What what did you what did you feel when that happened and you got captured by the yeah. Chinese? That the that jammy ke sindi ga ne pala sembe na la chwa khande da uji ke swe. Ah jammy ke sindi le ta khande da che che guna samne sheno chambundu tri sheno ya na me ke sem sare wa che ayo mare. Uh when uh they caught me uh I was very scared. And I wondered what would happen to me, but I was helpless. Maybe he could just tell the story, and then you could. Well, the man's son of Jigido. Ah, tell the man's. Man's son of Jigido. Oh yeah, yeah. Then, that nobleman, nobleman, tell me, right? Nobleman, the jarambo chege, tosonche sa nobleman ha kogro wa tenare. That ten only ten jami ge simja jige. Oh. Me, Xiao, Luan, Gepo, Gemo, Tren, Chugu, Tendanda, Chunye, Kondu, Linka, Tepe, and Mir Kondu. Tren, Aga Samnole, Atande, so Tren, the Xiao Luan, the Pugu, and the Tong, Tren, and Chugu, Mare, Chin, and San Senole, Tren, and Ketchetin, Cheton, or Dana Karche, and they in the Ketchetin. The Ketchetin Dule, Tiri kacau jam itu seni tuan baru ya segitiga. Tiri ngah tuan baru ni ambil le. Tiri ngah jodoh tena novel ini kalle tuan phone ni cium le. Then we were taken to the novel inca. You would know that it is the summer palace of His Holiness the Dalai Lama. There, I the Chinese has also Chinese had also caught the lame, the blind. Old men, old women, and children who fills the garden, and I thought the Chinese wouldn't have caught the blind and the lame, and they can't be in prison. So I asked them what they were doing there, and they said that uh, the Chinese had caught them and that they were prisoners, and so we were prisoners together. Then, mm. <coughs> ah. Uh... Nobleman kalle, tiap separ jen rodi le, tene, pe, tenda nda, oh, megarotot thela do tenda, mumbo chun thongdu, 
Tre te so carere se dule. Tre no bu lenka le mejo jo. Mejo jo ni mepse gaji. Tre mero jakoze tenra tena le ya nyom de meta ton gre se ndu. Ta te du tali lama jaga le prendo prendo sermen se tali lama ta yero se ni tene ko so no bu lenka le mejo jo gendo mejo jo bam jo tende che gre. Pe me mo bu meta ton ndu tena. Then a little further away from the noble Inca, I could see, you know, smoke and ashes. Mm -hmm. And I, I asked what it was, and I was told that these were uh, the corpses, hundreds of corpses that were burned after the bombardment of the noble Inca. I had His Holiness not fled. Uh, they, you know, their intention and hope was that His Holiness had not fled, and they bombarded the noble Inca. And these corpses were burned uh, uh, using kerosene oil. Tere tena de dule, tere jami ge ngondole, jami te pele yunga tende, pele te tere pele yunga, chita dam ge yore de te chitu ma ma yin se kuto chita chungi yin peme thole deshi yunga che do yumbi yin se tere. Ngabda asom seya nanda do tene pe 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 pa tsong ge to po seya tene pe <hesitation> sobda mo tsuba <hesitation> memo le to po tong lu <hesitation> tene ko tsong ge ta <hesitation> pe me tsong le ya po seya ge se tene da tsong tsong ni ma ta pa ri he si ju lo ge si ju tere si ju lo he tene da lo tene da lo ge. Then um, the Chinese uh, told us that uh, they had come to Tibet to liberate the Tibetans. They were the liberation army and they had come to Tibet to bring happiness. And that so far Tibetans had been oppressed by the uh, leadership, uh, the three leadership classes. And they had not set up any schools. Uh, however, that they were there to change everything. And then they uh, gave us propaganda lessons. And also uh, taught us songs. Then they got to the Bele or Gudado or Meson Chupo, Tetsonga, Zindan, Soma, Tanke, or Semne, Zenle Ju. Then Tetsonga, Kimi Tetsonle, Gole Shamo Caboyo, then Chapa Ponge, Jandawalazo, Chapa Ponge. Che, tre cotton le chuni, o cotton adatti reseni, o permetole, chui tumpe, gemiti, cacciun tracho umare, tende zendu. At that time, uh, the aristocrats and the wealthy people had been captured and imprisoned, and their women were adorned with a white hat, and they were made to clean the toilets, and uh, These people that were categorized in the uh, uh, ruling class were not allowed to speak to other people. Mm. Were you seeing this? Uh, I mean, if you were a prisoner in Norbalinka, uh, how did you know this was happening? Palagi, don't you see you now, guys? Now, Palagi, that Norbalinka is now a Zimbabwean city. Yes. Oh, Zimbabwean, they are the national. When you go to the country, I was in prison, and uh, out of uh, those people, some of those people that we knew, they used to bring food for us, and then they told us that this was happening. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Did you know why you were put in prison and how long you were going to be there? And Palagirwa. Kami kitsongan al karichen tu ime ta gur ringle tsongan al daya ime tedu kengi yena. Tedu shege mare de tere ta taru ten kacha 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 jo de ta ta tombo ne tanda tindi kacha kacha ni si ni ni si shege ni tere gamba soma tor tere lama tsong tere ne chu tere me tsong chupo ge jinda tsong chu jero wa. Tetapi orang yang jono so sun sama tamke, ada sel do mui do, kunda ya sih tetapi sun sama kono ngaji paku, tetapi orang yang jutja lam sama tamke, ma memole gosip jauh. Tetapi cecah sun seni, tangga kalah cengi, 
Nagi, I send send on a Timmy to take it from a log day. Make him at the big house? I send, I send, I send Nale Kalashega, Chapo Dinre Zastin, Tamare Yundogre, Tapa Riche, Mondo Pinjan Dogre, Molhasa de Dale. And uh, also, you know, uh, I had no knowledge then, mm -hmm. and also uh, monasteries were destroyed then, and the, the lamas had been imprisoned, and the wealthy people were in prison, and their wealth, which consists, which might consist of gold, silver, uh, were taken away by the Chinese, and the others were distributed among the people, and all these things were told to me by a woman named Asen who was related to us, and she used to bring me food once in seven days, and she lived in Lhasa. Mm. Mm -hmm. How long were you in that prison? I mean, it's on the Shiragi Page or Cots on the Tungi, Shirace or Maroa, Shira Tulleres, Tungi, Eduta Chen, a Tonkon or two Yai de Meleka Ku Marise, Trin Nale, Dang Agustin, Trin or Lassa Lingle, Jamig Mami, Comba Dogon, Comba Lessel, Leka Chicken Tons. Then uh, we were there for around five months being given propaganda lessons. And since there was no serious charges, um, you know, normally I heard that if there were serious charges, you would be imprisoned and not sent out to work. Mm -hmm. But I was sent out to work in Lhasa, uh, constructing houses uh, for uh, Chinese soldiers. Mm. Mm. What was that like, that experience? And the di kangba yaga tangdu gane di kabla nyamnyong kande jawish dia. Nyamnusena in, in the four directions, there were Chinese guards with machine guns, mm. and the workers were the prisoners. And uh, if they, um, you know, um, ran away, they would get killed. So, um, and then for food, there was a sack of tsampa there and some black tea, which had no butter but some salt, and we were forced to work the whole day. And do you think your family had any idea, uh, Pala, about what happened to you? you? Did they even know you got made it to Lhasa? Did they know you had been imprisoned? How, 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 how was that sitting with you? How were you handling that? Palagi, Namito Yora, my Payulea. Any consugi tapal hasal jory you may dan, Tsemba cha you may dan, Dindigi needs you could do carichiguna. A chick cogio mare. Nakarn and ta hasal yore samia demense, cogio mare, te coble, Monzo Payinia, Mota Longa yo mare, three yaman roche ching and Mishira yo mare. Monzo get Pama debo yo made the test of chingy. Um, my parents knew nothing whatsoever. They might have thought I was in Lhasa. And uh, in those days, from my hometown, there were no vehicles. And I also had no knowledge about them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what happens next in terms of your imprisonment? And how do you get out of there? And 
tenale tene mame cho gele mame tene ya tene tenale shin tene shin len tene so shan ten tene tenale ka ku de Then I was taken from Lhasa to Kongo where there was a very thick jungle and uh, which had a barbed wire around it and on all four directions there were soldiers with guns and then I was made to do logging. I was sent to is that what I missed that word. I was, I was taken from Lhasa to Congo. Oh, taken from Lhasa to Congo. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. As Congo, a prisoner. Gunso, Gunso, Gunso. Gunso. It was called the region was called Gunsang. Mm-hmm. Um, and were there many prisoners that went with you, Pala? Zeba mabu nyamdo chi yuna. Oh, tenale ngavi nyamdo senjaji miki mense ngando miki mense tena tong masung. Yendagi tenale komba zosa lega lendo yor. Only the two of us were sent to this region mm-hmm. while the rest were constructing houses. Mm-hmm. At at Gunsang there were many other prisoners. Mm. Mm-hmm. And what were the conditions like? What good is there except suffering in a prison? And uh, it was only Tsamba that uh, on which was Tsamba and black tea on which we survived. Uh, there was no meat, there was no butter and no vegetables. Tri kumbo no dan ro dile tri nga tron ro sam yi ge sam no kos ta tin yi tro dile le la bo rendi yo re ta kumbo no le ni tsu jaga le ro na le la bo rendi re tri ni ro po tin dile ta tsamba sa dile tsamba ti si ti si kuma ku sho sin tsamba nyunzi nyunzi kuma ku ni nya sho tri ngi ni tron ro di sagre se sin At Congo, I wanted to make my escape and it would have been easy to go from Congo to India. So I told my colleague that uh, we should try to, you know, hide some Tsamba and uh, he too did and we were able to get this much of Tsamba. Mm-hmm. Nematile Tre uh Tsamba Tits the Ku Tre Chenle Tanda uh Zemarango Chari uh Chari or Zemarang. Then Dre Ya Chan Tre Tini Dream. Tretas Dinima Tretas. Yeah. One day uh carrying that little bit of Tsamba where we went beneath a barbed wire and succeeded in escaping. Mm. <laughs> Then I went to my sister's house where I'd lived earlier and there I asked her to give me some tsampa and meat and and with four other people I fled to India. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Then we crossed over the uh, uh, Bakala, the mountain pass, mm-hmm. and uh, came into Michuka, which is uh, uh, 
uh, Indian territory, and there the uh, Indian government had set up an office, an office to help the fleeing Tibetan refugees, and I was we were given tampa and medicines. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Um, we were uh, 10 days there, and during the escape journey, uh, each of us had horses. So once we reached there, we gave up our horses and saddles and then uh, went on foot. Mm-hmm. So, um, Pala, what was in your mind when you were a prisoner and then when you uh, succeeded in escaping? What were you thinking about doing or what were you hoping for? Till I reached Indian territory, uh, there was a lot of fear and panic in me. Mm-hmm. But after crossing over into Indian territory, I thought now I will get to see His Holiness the Dalai Lama mm-hmm. and I no longer have to uh, live under Chinese and I was very happy. Mm-hmm. So what happened to you next, Pala? then uh, we reached uh, Miss Murray, and the Indian government had uh, built huge bamboo huts with sleeping areas on both sides and an aisle in the middle. And there were around 20 people that were preparing food, and we got food, water, medicine. There was there was very good um, reception. Mm-hmm. Um, though um, the reception was good, uh, some villagers from uh, Tibet, they perhaps they had eaten, uh, you know, um, stale food or did not have no any hygiene. Every day, three to four people died, and then they were cremated there. Then, um, then <laughs> Uh, then seeing people dying every day, 
I had a dread that I would also die. Mm -hmm. And after 20 days, I received the uh, refugee permit uh, issued by the Indian government. And then I fled to Kalimpong. Oh. Why Kalimpong? Kalimpong has okay. any pain? Eh? Kalimpong has a pain. 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 Kalimpong there, was, there wasn't any other objective, but only that Kalimpong is located at a higher altitude mm -hmm. and it, it wouldn't be hot. Mm -hmm. And what happened there to you? Then Kalimpong la haru chungye na pala. Then Kalimpong lem ro dule ngag ngoshe pa tenra hang khang wa meki do gongjo wa meki ni kwa chong le tere to se ki pe sha yong ye pe mjo yong ye tenra rendu. ตึงงอนซอเปยเนี่ยเอ่อเปยกับจ๋าโลเทนระเปมอนโบคุเจยุงบินเดนนากุนชอกเรนดูชิงโรกมุนดูตึงเอ่อตะคอนโซยิงก
and at that time I had a, a gold ring that weighed about uh, 40, 40 grams mm. that I had brought from my hometown and they, the traders said that it would be uh, good for me to sell it and then I sold it for 225 rupees then and also my mother had uh, given me a, a sea and two corals and I sold the sea for 200 rupees but no one would buy the corals and I suffered a great deal then. Oh. How long were you doing? You said, uh, uh, how many months? That was quite six months. You were selling, acting as a trader. And that was true. Papa Gipuda? And uh, after the goods were sold in six months, uh, we bought pig hair and mask and took them uh, to India. Oh. <coughs> it sounds like you decided to continue trading instead of, uh, I don't know, going back to Tibet or joining the Chushigan group, which you had planned to do. Then <laughs> The border le deni da tu le kala saya do tere magel le o the kepson the komo jach me ramasu komo jach re jach re thau gun kepson chi komo du kala saya the kepson le. So after we arrived in India and sold the pig hair and mask, and uh, after deducting the food and other expenses at Bauda, each of us got a profit of rupees eighty. Uh huh. We're laughing because. Tere tere tini manga jagale absang chole chimiye absang absang ranga parase se tenale hongye sakon sambi. Then I went to Rangapara in Assam and I set up a restaurant. Tere ta tena restaurant simye dev jawa. Did <laughs> Mare jam jammy mam le wound you three pepper tits on the sunzo could you cut or jany yumbere ma Yat thoughts a uh boom the last and a thoughts a burg sun sun. Then in nineteen sixty two uh China China attacked India and uh, at the um, at Bomdila <coughs> which is on the Tibetan border there were many Tibetans Tibetan shops and the Chinese when the Chinese came they fled with their goods. Trite chala te kogun dule ta real gadi non le chala kub thog mare me me so ma pyon do gor real non me kon do chala kum thog gun tre kon do chala pe mombo ten da chi ni ge sa kon non le ja ni tan de chel pen thog sun na ngale shuma cheka chero chi pe man to na ni tre char chi kon che ayo mare se ni kho to chala so ma ni sa kon non le ya pe de chipa chi su tre ya and these, could, and these goods could not be transported on trains because the trains were crowded with people fleeing. And uh, so all these uh, Tibetan shopkeepers, they left their goods with me, saying that if they are useful to you, please use it. And if not, you can just throw them away. If you've been able to use, you can pay me half later. Uh -huh. Any? Ah, uh, Trim, Natanale, Chapo Summons a dear Tomason. 
ते खरे से न जगह के मिच्चो बोते सोता यों या ते द गुरु या लोने फोचुं चे देख दो तेरे नाते नाले तुम की चे गुनु दे दे मातो ने ना के साखों के योचन सोमा यू ना चे तो जावे but uh, I was able to remain there only for three days because the poor Indians started raiding everything and then I left my restaurant and fled. Then leaving behind everything because I couldn't carry the food stuff or the utensils or the glasses and with nothing, I fled to the other side of the Ganges. Uh, so all those uh, goods that had been left in my care were also left there. And at Gauhati, uh, the Indian government had set up tents uh, where lived all the Tibetans and Indian Indians that had fled from the Chinese and uh, the college boys and girls were helping. Mm-hmm. Then uh, we were near the Ganges and uh, from the boats and then trucks they would bring over woolen blankets that were distributed uh, to all the um, people that had gathered there and then Tibetan government officials came there and they asked if any of the Tibetans there wanted to enlist into the army at Dehradun. Mm. And now I'm going to talk about my training. Okay. <laughs> Then, um, in my mind, I thought, you know, in my own country, I was not able to move freely, but imprisoned, and I had to flee. Now I am in a foreign country, and also I have been made to flee. Now I must fight the Chinese, and then I decided to join the army. Mm-hmm. And uh, we were taken to Siliguri, where a physical examination was done for the many people that were enlisting, and 139 were selected, and we were taken to Darjeeling to be sent to America and not to join the army. 
for two months we were in Darjeeling where we were taught the Tibetan script. Then after two months they put us in a plane and flew us to the United States. American Japan on the way to America, we spent two nights in Japan and then we continued to US and to a, a place that I'm not able to recall the name. It was 1962 when I went to America. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. ตะเนตะนาเลคอมบานอนเลซาวโลโดตุงโลตะเนซายันทุงยาติโซเปนมาซีบะเกกุงาโดติโซซายันทุงยาเปยะปนดูโอตะเนคะลาตินดายะปน
Tripaka Perle, Tendecin, Somi di Tutu, Hundule, Terin, uh, Tigiti, the Nitsu, the Hamagovace, or Tangoti Swim, the Hamagovace, the Tesota, or Perle, di Tutu, Yago Colle, Tel, uh, Thousand Ton at the Tatere. Terin, Tig Shule Rua, Tig Shule Terin, or Mandalin Hungaria, Terin, uh, so the main um, part of the training was setting up a secret organization in Tibet. So they taught us how, you know, the orders must be followed and how, you know, those that uh, were below should not know about the one that was giving the commands. And then there was training in um, firing uh, pistols, machine guns, artilleries, and different kinds of guns. Mm -hmm. Pala, can I, can I just interrupt and ask, where were you? Or this? Where was this training taking place? Do you know the name of the place, or did you call this place by name? Uh, they never revealed the name of where we were being trained. Okay, the name of the place. Tre <laughs> The Tibetan government and the U.S. Uh, main objective was that you know uh, to drop us into Tibet and then uh, set up a secret organization there which is the reason why we were taken to the U.S. However, you know, the Indian government was not in agreement to this, mm -hmm. and so we were refused to be dropped. They refused uh, to let us be dropped, and uh, that was why we were there for three years without any work. And then later, you know, um, it was decided that we would be trained, 36 of us would be trained to lead Tibetan soldiers in the Indian Army in Dehradun, and I was one of them. that was why we were in the U.S. for three years without work. And in 1965, we were sent to India. Uh, I was sent with three other colleagues. And then um, from Michuka, uh, we were uh, sent into Tibet. 
तेरे मंदो फागर हो जान चेदी इंची की मैं गरे गुरे से रहते तार पंग में तेरे लाने तो हो जान स्टेप गया तार 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 से ना तार पर तो रह चाहिए रेडियो हमारे वाइल्स ते पर तो रह चाहिए यार मंदो तार से गया तार पंग में लेखुं दोंगनी पला ले तेरे चाहिए यार कल हो जान स्टेप गया गरे गुरे but before the when you were trained um, when you were trained in Colorado uh, by the U.S. you had to stay three years because the Indian government wouldn't give permission to the American government to drop you into Tibet. <clears throat> but they gave permission for you to come to India and train Indian soldiers who were <clears throat> fighting the Chinese? Uh, Tibetan soldiers in the Indian army in Dehradun. They were allowed to come and do that? Yes. Uh -huh. And then <coughs> I thought that you said you were training, then you were going to go to Dehradun. train uh, to train the Tibetan soldiers in Dehradun and send them into Tibet. เนี่ยอันดับอืมถ้าทางบัวว่าถ้าอยากให้ชุนกี้อเมริกาชุนเลยอ่ะถ้าเทวดาชัวทางบัวเทวีเอ่อเพื่อนพาลันนั่งจุ
we must go and then set up civic organizations in Tibet, and we were ready to do that. Mm -hmm. Can uh, Pala, can you remember the names of any of the American trainers? Propagella, America, Lokjong Tengi, Gigan, the day or wa, Gigan Kashi, Jigan Ming, Tengi, the well, Tanda Sanga, Tangi, Ming, Ting, Mihakog. No, I do not know the names of any. Did you know? Trendy, Thorn Rate, Dilile, America, Yondo, or Jaga Yon. ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、ぐ、
You know, we, if I felt that I would have no regrets if I died because I was dying for the Tibetan people and I was willing to follow any orders that were given. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, I was dro uh, dropped from the airplanes many times. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, uh, and I want to hear about that experience, but if 136 Tibetan men were sent to train in America, uh, are there any of those men still living besides yourself that, that you know about? Um, I do not have much knowledge because many were killed and many were caught by the Chinese mm -hmm. and perhaps, you know, there were only 40 to 50 left. Do, do you, Pala, do you know if any of them are still living? Uh, there are three in Kathmandu area. Uh, there's one called Tempo Pula, and, and in, in the whole of Nepal, I think only three of us are there. Mm. So, Tempo Pula and, and the other names you, you don't know? Tempo Pula da Shemba de Suimbo. 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 Uh, I don't know his name, but he lives in Border area. Okay, okay. And then, so go, please go on with your story. You were going to go train the Tibetan army, but that didn't work. Mm -hmm. And so you, what happened then? And the time, and Pala Lupin Alia, the Tango, and the Redun, the Pribe Mami, the Jonga Jaga Paya, Jenny Dinet, and any Pila Patang Swa, and the Patishumi. ตะเพลนโดดเลยเอ่อเพลเลอืมมิซอมเทเนเอ่อที่กุงบอกกุงเตอเซเซเตนาเลมิซอนจีลิตูเอ่อมิซอนจีลิตูบิงกาเรกุ
gare gore ngondo tsa lemasu tiring ngondo en pel lemas tiring ngondo yong jaga le tsul lobi So um, then I went into Tibet with three men. Uh, uh, we left uh, Gregory at the uh, Indian uh, border town of Michuka and went into Kongbo. And uh, uh, we were to stay with a family in Kongbo. And uh, they were to provide us with food and news of what was happening in Tibet. And then um, we were to relay this news over wireless to the uh, office in Delhi. And uh, so Gregory was to come and meet us at a certain place. But then the Indian government did not permit him to uh, leave. And we returned um, back to India. We returned to India. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dilini, Kiton Gubja Tuchu Redu, Tilly, Kiton Gubja Tuchu Redu, or Yong Ale, or Gain Tarisayati, or Mepasayati, Yim Tony, Yong Kumba, Kumba Kumhele, Pelas Hunsen Tomri. Sulo, Gain Tarisay, Tagains and Anginets on the Pelkir, or Tari Kuga Minte, and American Mint Tarisay, Kil Maps. Map. Map. Then <laughs> 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 Uh, an order arrived from Delhi saying that uh, Taring, Map, and I should go uh, to low to the lower region of Kongo. And Taring and uh, Map, Taring and Map were also uh, trained uh, like me. Taring, Taring, Taring and Map were American, American names. Canadian. Canadian. Taring is American. Okay. And, and with these American names, they were actually Tibetan people. Correct. Correct. Okay. Taring and Map. Uh, oh, so under order that Taring and Matt were to go to and and uh, and to go to Lower Kongbo in and Tibet. Stewart. It's and Stewart. Stewart okay, to go to Lower Kongbo. And Stewart, okay. Okay, to Lower and do what? I mean, Kongbo Mel, Ma Johnny Karichi, Lagre. That Kongbo Mel, that Mando, that Pearl and Ronnie, that America, or Pearl Union, get to that Pearl and Ronnie, Pearl and Dead. Train permits on this suit too, or train so on the dissuit to grace a tanda terrace, so on this suit song in Chad and Dogger. The region we were going into Tibet uh, was to set up, set up a secret organization there. Mm-hmm. Train, uh, or Jaga Sansa, Jochens, a psychic, or Tenale, Jaga Sassum, Mamma Desa, Tena Garki, or Tenale, Mepo Tenale, Ya, Ten Territine, Tena Pombo no Lesson. Pombo Tomodon, Tomodon says at Tena Lesson. Kawa? Tomodon. Chomuza, and Gidagas, Jagagi, um, Map Shasta Your chance in your chance. Your chance at a Satya Tena Sasum Mammy Maganda Kire, Mammy Mammy Tots a day or Mombo Yomare. Then um, we left map at uh, Jorchen, which is on the Indian border, where there was a small Indian military camp, and then the two of us went to Jomodong. Jomodong, Lemdo Dile, Trentinale, Sinam, Chu, Senior, Miki, 
Tinakum on a den on a ted or two in a tetu de la tricoge ta sache do trenici or tetu or trens on dena dena or curopa cheto semi cog kelendi. I met up with one Sanam Ojo who had agreed to provide food and means to us. Tretti Kelen de Lata, Perlen, Deto Greta, Perle Dani, Tasman, we did to go and do some yet. Tren Gent Harry sang it in the Le, Tapagele, Jami Magado, Tren, or Tendale, Pajau Jazi Pinchodo, Tren Page Perg, Nichit and the Cuny, Gent Harry Jagal Tombi. Gent Harry Jagal Tong, I keep what Tenan does some day. Pin <laughs> Then uh, we were in Tibet for some time, and then I sent a tarring uh, back to India to Jochen, where map was waiting uh, with uh, films uh, of the pictures we had taken, and I remained in Tibet for another three months. Mm -hmm. Can you say what city you were in Tibet? Jongmotsong. Uh, Jongmotsong. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And what were you doing while you were in Jongmotsong? In Jongmotsong, I was some shudu and a kariman shure. Then Jongmotsong, like China, seen the Diego Grim is a tea and a Yichichas like the Zeg, Miss Medule, China, seen the Danny, Tren Jami Maga, Kandus, a telepajau, a Tresna on to the Tuni, Snam to the Nala Sachete, Trekog and Nichitende, a kid there. Tren ta um tena ne su tundu dile tre lumba tege mete son jarre mbo chele pe tepa do pe sengu chembo rendu tre nge disu chembo che tu to sare sam nga ge pe poba chembo sheso tre nge me jaj temba ge o me semchu yang me jaj temba ge a minto te dili ge goti chole ton te so nga ge disu no ki una ndigre ga mare se I would be uh, hiding in the forest because you couldn't trust anyone. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, then I was um, um, scouting around where there were Chinese military camps and then taking pictures. And uh, I would meet Sanam Wangchu who would provide me with food and uh, meals. And I was told that uh, the region, the people of the region, they're very firm believers of His Holiness, the Dalai Lama. Mm -hmm. And I felt very proud that I could set up an organization here. And I sent the names of 80 people to mm -hmm. Delhi uh, to seek permission if I could enlist them. Mm -hmm. mm. Trin, mm, uh Tetondu Latine, Mozon Dilili Yonge, America, the Jaga, Pregun Songe, Leje Patetonge, or Mozole Goyag Yala Teton, US, Lomdo de Jaga Sansan, Leje Page, or Gumco Tifero Mejeni, or Das Sum Son Le Caposome Medu Yeni, Gumco Conil, Nagropo Tari, the Mapu in the Tend. Dream this one's an. Then our office in Delhi um, had sent the required items that we needed in Tibet. Um, many months back but these had not been received by my colleagues and when they did it was time for us to have 
met and in a hurry instead of avoiding the main road they came to meet me on the uh, main road and were caught by the chinese mm. Then tang ak ti bo pha ge le den ni ta o da song wi tin le tu ya ge sa che ro te nam ge gu ni stan do du le te ko ni yong ya yo ma re ta ko ni ja me ge sim sa ro te ja me ge sim sa re de ja me ma me che ni nga sim na sim cho cho yo re de ko ni me nge ba re do nga ge nga te na le yo se chu ni lo ma la ni nga sim cho sim cho yo ma re me sim cho na ko ma me che ni nga tu san de na re nga le ro po yo se na nga sim sa ro I was alone for three months and then I waited for my colleagues at the scheduled waiting place and they didn't arrive because they had been caught by the Chinese and they were really good men because had they revealed that we had an appointment at such a place, they could have brought the Chinese soldiers along mm. and had me caught, sure. but they didn't. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then, Tanga Pearl Neto Yomar, Niropo Nimone, Tanga Tren to Jagal Soloyum, Narunkibo Himalal Pe, Kumurichambundu, Tren Kumonole, Marki Dibson, the Chuni. Kutsa mena donga na kunduno le devsun de tre kale kale cheni mashwa cheni tre jagale so lotus istan kale de kapom pe momo jadne Then I could no longer remain in Tibet and uh, <coughs> came to India and uh, on the Himalayas it was covered with snow and I would have sunk into the snow had it not been for the load that I was carrying. Mm. It was during autumn season. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then, um, may put a catch at home with some machine that a lot you didn't let them come to the may put it a pass to any tongue to the Nebali left, not a tooth. May put lock you didn't come to the Nebali left, not a tooth. Turning logic in the matter. Turning red, lock you didn't. May put that some corner then yet. Tando. Mare mare tai ni tai ta tombo o tari lo kyu din de ni pa jami pa sre ni tere nebal ni sel sun se tido tere nebal le gun de ni tari le ke cha ti du le tere me pu o ta chang kono le de ndre wa ta te ki lo na ya pu yo te ke cha mo wo yo ta mo le pa lo when questioned uh, tarin spoke honestly and the chinese sentenced him to 17 years in prison and after serving his time in prison, he was uh, uh, given permission and came to Nepal, where I met him. Mm. Before, before this, oh. uh, Paolo, what, what were you carrying? Uh, at, first of all, you were alone for three months in the Himalayas, in the mountains? By, no, in by, that place in called that, uh, uh, Chongmotong. In, Chongmotong, in uh, India. No, in uh, Kompo. I mean in Kompo. Mm. And, um, and you were by yourself, and uh, uh, when the colleagues did not come to the appointment yeah, right. place, yeah. then um, he left to go into uh, India, India, and on the way passed through the Himalayas. On the way. Yes. Mm-hmm. And, and what were you carrying in that pack? I was <laughs> Tell a Manda Bista, a business Bist of Manda Kujur. Tere Parche Kujur. Tere so it does a tender Kujur. Tere do judge a Kujur. Tere Chedule Tala Chonchon, Kilopianga de Kujur. 
Tine I was carrying a gun, a camera, a compass, 100 rounds of bullets, uh, food, clothing, which amounted to about 15 kilograms. Total love the year. Paula, do you want to tell us uh, about map? Is that what we're at? Mm, map. Paula, a map la karichune or please to suma. Tell us about map, please. Oh, ah. So, um, uh, Map was uh, our wireless operator, and when he was in the prison, he uh, sang a song saying, Rise up, rise up, Tibetans, let's, dis let's destroy the Chinese. And then he was taken out to be interrogated by the Chinese. There were two Chinese soldiers that tied him up and took him outside, and there was the uh, Chinese uh, army commander that was interrogating him and he was threatened with the guns and when they did so he picked up a piece of brick and threw it at the commander who fell down and then the two soldiers they uh, caught him tied him up with his legs and hung him day and night when he was almost <coughs> dead then uh, they called gathered all the prisoners the soldiers the locals and then they uh, announced that Map is one who had been trained in America and that he was spying in China and that he'd almost killed the commander and that he should be killed. And they took him away, uh, dug a hole in the ground and then stretched out both his hands, tied them by uh, ropes uh, with a, um, um, a dark, drew a dark spot on the center of his uh, chest and they shot him dead. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Then the Chinese, uh, because they knew I had visited my sister, uh, they surrounded her house every night and washed it for two years. But since I didn't go there again, I couldn't be caught. Mm. Then I went a third time into Tibet to check what happened to map and could return uh, successfully. And I knew that the Indian government was very much against the secret organization being set up in Tibet. Uh, 
मंथिंग लेखुं ते तक गौर जाओ रे लेखुं तो मागे दिल्ली लेखुं तो गौर जाओ रे गौर जाओ दिल्ले फिर एक जगह के नाले लोग बंदो चुनो जगह के लेका ची मागे खुद तो जगह के हेड काम हेड काम कांस्टेबल से जाते हुए कनेक्ट है घूम से बंदो ते कंडे यहाँ मगो हेड कांस्टेबल के कनेक्ट है वो जगह के लेका ची से नाले लोग बंदो Due to a friction between the U.S. and Indian government, the office was closed, and the Indian uh, people they told me to work for them, and that they would give me the title of a of a head constable. Atrenge jaga ke leka chhe me, na jaga leka chhe andar pa yo mare. But I didn't because I didn't want to work uh, with the Chinese. Uh, sorry, Indians. Atrenga tini pejunge. अतें नेपाल इन तोंस की तोंग जो टूच रेगुलर रेगो रे रे टूच रेगुलर नेपाल इन तोंस तेरे नेपाल इन ले जामे दो थेवे निंगे ले लेका चेंगे ते सोले स्टार्टो चेंगे लेंगे रे थेवे दो जामे निंगे स्टार्टो कहाँ दिस स्टार्टो ताक खोसों खोसों के बेजुन नंगे लेका चिच्चे को दुस्ता करवा� तेना कुछ समान लेंगे सब अच्छे लोग बोलता। Then in 1969, the Tibetan government sent me to Nepal to to study what China and Taiwan were doing to observe what they were doing against Tibet. तेरें देना ले रोंचें सोचूंगे लेका चे तेरे लेका चे भी नहीं। Then I here in Nepal I worked for the Tibetan Freedom of Movement। हम्म तेरे ता ते की ता इंगे ना इधर भी इंगो ता ते की शोले तेरे शोप जो दिनचर्या में बच्चे ये तेरे नाले कोरी साले शोसुंगे तेरे ता मिलित हो या तो पे मासिब कबले खबर रहे से ते सुनता नहीं मिलित हो दिले छोट की माइड्रोम ना तेरे जो लोंसे तो उन आसों जब बनोगे या ना ची कौन पहन तो यो मारे से जो नो सो सुगे पहन तो गु मारे जुप्पो यान के यान यं रोग रे छोट चीज़ से नाले सब जी दरों दंजों नंबर चेक ते सुनता then a Dunjum Rinpoche asked me to come to him and told me that to take a human birth is very, very difficult. And once you have attained human birth, you must do some practice. Because even if you were wealthy, as wealthy as a king, it is useless. Because one day you have to leave everything and your body. तेरे आ नेपाल इन्हें चुन्दा जाओ तेरे याचे माचे नहीं तो तो सोगे ले कंगे में नहीं रह सों तेरे ना चढ़ा रहे बोचे ले ना लोसुंदा सों सांग जारो चीज़ से चुरी नहीं तेरे चढ़ा रहे बोचे के लोटी इन्हें दे गो दो तेरे सांग जारो से तेरे चढ़ा रहे बोचे के सेम अगर नियम दे लेते जाके आ � साम जे तेरे ना तंदा चोगल चोल हुई हो रहे चो चो चेत देख हुई हो रहे से तंगा सीधों में लेगा लेगी हमारे हर लेगा सर तंगी नहीं सी Then my mind am turned towards the dharma and I had I I have you know I have no problems in my life because of you know I've done some business and I am uh, able to survive, and uh, then Shadow Rinpoche, I requested that I wanted to go into retreat, and then with his daughter, I went to Yomo and uh, did a retreat for three years and three months, and now I am into the practice practicing the Dharma and no longer into politics. Papa uh, पागे योगले चले गुरु रंबोचे सोंसे के सोंग के जिंजाजी के को फुटक्यू सुन्चे बाकी 
te sada rambo chelenge te yingi sedu kal lagon on le ngur rambo chiku mombo men soma yingi ore tre ngur rambo chiku te yina ne langa kale men soma ge phonsa le yingo yo tre ku do tre bezan guru tenda budu tenda phonya yonge tenda ki yina ku do tre khori ge bezan guru budu ten sug phonsuna phondo yinse ni tre phage lenga Putu singe guru mochi ki yin tuk sung se. Beza guru putu yin tuk. Beza guru ota sung le beza guru tini ya to tiki ya budu tenda ki budu sena ta ya mburdu ni tenda tenda ki tini o langwa kale tenda ki yana kudo <hesitation> tenda ki beza guru yin tong sung na tenda ki <hesitation> soma tong ro yin se ni te sung se tenda ki tenda ki yin tuk se. Tere tanga ge mesen de gile ka te nyi ye ngal ta ti shoya me. And then um, then I was able to uh, you know, at Swayambu I was able to construct a money prayer wheel, mm -hmm. and then I wish to do something more. And we uh, asked Chada Rinpoche who said that I sh uh, should you know build a image of the Guru Rinpoche and that. There were many such images in temples, but if this could be built by the wayside, um, along with an embossed uh, guru mantra, that would be very helpful, uh, and everybody could see it. And I uh, succeeded in building a 13-foot image of Guru Rinpoche, and that's about all in my life. There is a lot to talk about the dharma, but let's stop here today. But if we have one, one question, what do you think it has been the most important teaching of the dharma for you? What has helped you change the direction of your life? Tan tombo ya chobul shudule <laughs> terem bunga sa ne zupo ditiri ta ya ge chedum bunga sa go go rwa ditiri ta ya la <laughs> tren te bunga sa dule shamro senshe yebja nende tren dosem tren lamin nam jo ge chambo sa go go tangan sam de de te so sabre Tren tiki shule tren ta <hesitation> losam rendo dule ta kecha mombo shia gimi losam rendo dule tren lama ge tren ngondo le nomba sonje pa ge semchi siki noya yore semchi seya tende semba nde ta semba tele ta kar kar che go go yome nas. So initially when I began practicing the Dharma, uh, there are the five uh, commitments that you have to um, perform in order to you know, wash away your negative thoughts and actions. So these are the uh, 100,000 prostrations, 100,000 mandalas and such. And um, this I did when I was in the retreat for three years. Then then the last one, then then the sajon che san ro dule. Then sempisi ki noya yore. Sempisi ya then semba te ta thande yeme. Then semba te semo thande sta go go yeme. This microphone don't touch. Huh? Mic. No. The microphone. Oh, then then ta. Lama ge te ngoi te gong di le tre <hesitation> che kung ngoi sung bang ngoi te gong di le tre te ya po chi ta to che tum na <hesitation> tre nong ba song che ba ge te so ya po chi ta to che tum na tre <hesitation> tre hin ro di le tu dan le yu se ni <hesitation> tre te chi tre to to che ni de gre tre <hesitation> tre <hesitation> gare ngya liu tu se ni <hesitation> kuzu chu ni ma ngye che ni <hesitation> <hesitation> Mangye tenda regre, tere <hesitation> ngare <hesitation> zupo te chung chung chandogre, <hesitation> tan nomba sonje bage 
छोले तीन डंडा के यंत्र योरे और तेसों सोचों छंसों छंसों आ की लामा शक्ति दिनों रंबोचे शादार रंबोचे और पेय पेनो रंबोचे तानुं से दूर रंबोचे आ दोसे ठंडे ना बोचे तो ने तेसो चाने ओं लूं ठी सोमा तम के थाउस तेरे आ के सामने लेता आ बहुत ही चीजों ने जम के बहुत ही सांडों दी जिना छोटो चाय आते ना आ ते चेंगे ढूंढ के रहें दो जिना ले उन दिल ले तेरे लामा ताचे मोते सम ये छोय आप तेरा थाम ने आ चेंगे ढूंढ के रहें दो सम ने ना तंदा सेवा गबो योसे सो आफ्टर अक्यूमल ड्यूइंग दिस अक्यूमलेशंस इन थ्री इयर्स देन द लामा वुड um, you know, instruct you into the centil, which is introduce, which is introducing your mind into the Buddha Dharma. And if one is able to practice this very well, you know, even after death, uh, you have consciousness. And uh, in, in some cases, you know, the body uh, just remains there, but it reduces in size when you know, your breath has left your body. And in that way, you know, I'm able. I was able to receive. A lot of empowerments and instructions, uh, oral instructions from many, many Rinpoches in India. So in a way, you know, uh, it has been a blessing in disguise for me to have left Tibet and come here. And I am very happy now. We, th we are very, very happy to have heard your story. You've climbed many mountains. And, and the greatest one of all is the Dharma. Mm -hmm. Palagi Lugu Kone Pemasika, which owns that, and Palagi Tabin, Jimang Buddha, your race, Roa, has Sange Chugi reads a good Yakshu Chungshas. Thank you, Chichi. Last of all.